Hey guys, Coach Kelly here, official trainer for I Love Lacrosse TV. Today we're going to get into how to score more goals from the crease. So I get a lot of emails, a lot of people asking me that they struggle finishing from the crease. So first I want to just explain exactly what we're talking about because I'm not talking about like a back door or, or something like that. What we're going to talk about is specifically dodging from up top because it's a difficult pass when you're dodging to the crease because it's left to right or right to left. So if I'm coming from up here from the, the top left, um, you can see Matt at that cone, and I'll just show you what it's going to look like. So if I'm dodging, he's cutting to the crease, I'll throw it across, and he finishes, all right? Good. So that's the place we're talking about, because if, if you, the fees comes from below GLE, it's a little easier, but these, these left-right passes are, are tough. So we're going to go over some things. I'm going to give you some of my top three or four tips on how to finish on the All right, guys, so there, there are two drills. It's basically the same drill, but two versions of the drill that I'm going to show you um, on how to finish on the crease. So real quick, my, my tips for finishing on the crease, there's, there's a few rules, real important. Number one, the most important rule is that you have to get the shot off. So when you catch it there, you need to know, you can't catch it and not get the shot off. You've got, you have to be able to get rid of that ball. Super, super important. Number two, aim before you get it. So you'll notice Matt, when he's on the cone, he's gonna aim and then he's gonna call for the ball. Super important. And kind of part of that 2A is we're going low and away. So when in doubt, the rule's gonna be low and away and I'll explain why we wanna shoot there, but low and away. And then the third rule is gonna be, and you'll, you'll notice also, when I correct or when he's cutting, stick above your shoulder. You cannot finish down here. Um, if your stick's high up here, one, just like rule number one, we have to get the shot off. If it's a bad pass, it's easier to adjust. All right, so I'm just gonna get into a few reps. You'll probably hear me correct some things. Ready, guys? Aim and call for it. Go. Good, run through the ball. Good, try to stick. You want to do the ball. Aim first, stick up in the air, above the shoulder. Go. Good, awesome. Keep going. Up, stick higher, go. Good, great. So guys, real quick, the reason is low and away, right? So if I'm a goalie, a righty, lefty, it doesn't matter, but if I'm the goalie here, the pass is coming from here as he cuts, his body weight's coming across, and see how right it's open here. You always want to go low and away, right? A lot, a lot of people make that mistake and it's right here in their chest and it's a turnover. Super, super important, all right? So simple drill, you'll do it from both sides and you can do it hundreds and hundreds of times. Right, guys, so now the second version of this drill, just go back to my number one rule for scoring goals on the crease, you have to get the shot off. Really, really important. So what we do is we actually practice that. I'm gonna throw Matt the same drill, but I'm gonna throw some bad passes, some really hard, left, right, low at his ankles, high. You know, you need to practice. They're, all those passes are not always going to be good. The other team is also going to do their homework. They're also going to practice, and they're going to make plays on defense, and some of your passes might be affected. So you can watch real quick. Again, the point, we're still working on the same thing. Stick above the shoulder. When he can, he's going to finish low and away. But these are going to be tough passes, so we're really working on getting the ball off. Ready? Go. Good. Good snap. Watch it back. Go. Right. Again. Go. Good. All right. Next one. Go. Good. Early. That same for you. Ready. Go. Now it's gonna come late. Good. Good job. So you gotta get it off. Gotta get it off. Again. Go. Great. Right. Let's stick up. Stick up. Come. Good. Look at the top ones. Cross the body. Ready. Go. Good, one more. Kill it. Let's do one more before we kill it. Good. Good, nice job. Nice job, bud. So, awesome version. You should really practice that. Practice that way as well after you do the regular. I hope you guys liked our latest video. If you want a free lacrosse training workout that will help you add 10 miles per hour to your shot, just click here or click the link in the description, enter in your email, and I will send it directly to your email. Don't forget to subscribe, like us, or leave a comment. Until next time, keep working.